After reading this book, I think you have found three main aspects included. Number one is a smart board. Number two is the use of iPad. And number three, the educational theories and modern methods of teaching. Let me explain how these three main aspects affect the educational system in countries. I will use the Gartner Group model and the uh, Rogers Adoption model to convey my uh, view. But let me first divide these three aspects into two categories. The first category is the category which needs money and a strong economy. This category includes the use of a smart board and the use of iPad. While the second category, which doesn't need money, includes the use of educational theories and modern methods of teaching. As for smart board and iPad, you will find them raised from the technology trigger onto the peak like this. and then descend to the slope of enlightenment when a new modern one comes to life. But this happens only in the rich countries. As for the poor countries, you will find technology comes on the peak and descend quickly like, like this. Because this kind of technology needs to be applied in all govern rates, each school and each classroom. And this needs a huge amount of money, which is impossible for poor countries. As for Rogers adoption model, you will find modern technology in here, in early adopters, which are the most brilliant group of people. And you will find technology in here. And when you come to apply them in poor countries, you will find them laggards. And you will find the technology in here. Even if they are in a bad need of this technology, but there is no money. As for the modern methods of teaching, you will find them in here. Early adopters uh, in both po uh, poor countries and rich country uh, because they uh, don't need money at all. This is the end of uh, this video. I hope uh, you enjoyed it. And I hope I conveyed my point of view. Thank you.